Hey everyone, welcome back to Awesome Our Pop. The weather is heating up, so today I'm going to show you how to make these delicious popsicles with just four ingredients. These creamy, crunchy treats will keep you cool all summer long. But before we jump into it, if you're new to this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss any awesome videos. Alright, let's do this! Here's everything we'll need. For the chocolate, I'll be using this Nerdy Nummies melting pot. To make the ice cream, I'll use heavy whipping cream, sweetened condensed milk, and vanilla extract. We'll top it with some chocolate and color it with some food coloring. You'll also need some popsicle molds and sticks. So let's prep the molds by inserting the sticks. Now off to make the ice cream mixture. Pour in two cups of heavy whipping cream. Add in a teaspoon of vanilla extract and give it a good mix. Now let's add in half a cup of sweetened condensed milk. Super simple, your mixture is all done. You could just pour it into the mold like this, but I'm gonna color mine. Let's separate this into six cups. And then add in your food coloring. Here's red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Now let's pour it into the molds. For the last two molds, I'm just going to pour all the leftover color in. Let's pop this into the freezer. I'm going to leave mine overnight. Once they're frozen, they should look like this. Let's pop them out. Those turned out great! Let's go pop these back into the freezer while I melt the chocolate. So this Nerdy Nummies melting pot has a heating feature and a warming feature. Let's switch it all the way to the right and melt the chocolate. The top pot comes out like this so you can pour it easily. Let's add in a bag of white chocolate wafers. Then just mix it up until it's nice and smooth. That looks beautiful! Now let's color it. I'm going to try to make it a seafoam green color, just like the top of this pot. Just add in blue and yellow until it gets to the color you want. Then pour all of the chocolate into a tall cup like this. That way we can easily dip it. Ooh, that looks good! I'll set this onto a tray lined with some parchment paper. You could dip it that way or we can drizzle on the chocolate.
check it out. These turned out great. Time for the taste test and some ASMR sounds. That was delicious! I highly recommend this recipe. It was easy and tasty. Well, this was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks!